just had to stop for nature's call. Now I'm going to catch up to everybody, but it's nice to not be around other boats for a little bit. You can be really quiet and you're more likely to see game. We made real good time this morning. Covered eight miles in about an hour and 45 minutes, so we decided to push on another 10 miles. And we're still gonna get into camp at a decent hour. It's just a beautiful day for a paddle. The water's high, so we've got a great ground speed. We're moving right along. Not much for wind. Uh, just a beautiful day to be out on the river. bluebird day it's just gorgeous it's warming up but there's a little bit of a breeze so the bugs aren't too bad we've got about a mile and a half to go till we get to our spot for the night and we start off with a really pretty little set of rips As you can see here's our crew here and right on shore if I swing the camera around there's a big esker so the glacier dropped all these rocks here. That's why there's this little ridge. And if I keep swinging around, you'll see the rip that we're about to go down. And you guys can come along for the ride because it's a beautiful day. And some of you may be looking at me saying, that guy's not wearing a life jacket. And it's because one person in the party lost their life jacket, so I gave them mine. So if someone's going to get a ticket, I'd rather have it be me than them. But we've just had such a perfect, perfect water level here. It's high, but it's not too high, not like flooded out or anything. Current's kind of moving right along. I guess there are a few things that I could hit in this little rip here. Big rock right ahead. But not so many of them that it's really hard or I have to take drastic maneuvers. Lower water, way more technical. You gotta weave your way in and out of all the things there are to hit. And that's one of the reasons why spring is such a nice time to go canoeing in northern Maine. High water. Fewer things to hit. Smaller streams are navigable. But look at this weather, huh? Beautiful. I feel like on this trip we've made the jump from spring almost into summer. And it's just uh, the 20th of May today, 2024. People have been swimming in the river already. I've been up to my belly button. Probably go for a nice swim here today. Wash off the grit of the trip. Just came around the big bend to the right and then we see a few houses and we're back to the road and back to town. Been out for just about a week, had a great time. Uh, warm today, upper 70 degrees Fahrenheit, upper 70s. Feel like we went from spring into summer this past week, but man, what a nice trip. We had high water, the bugs didn't come out till right at the end. Blue skies and tailwinds. Nothing to complain about. So we're going to take a day and work on canoe rescue and do some advanced polling. Then we're going to have a day off to resupply and then we're headed out on the second trip 
of the four-week wilderness canoe expedition semester. Morale is high, people are getting along great, wouldn't change anything about it. Check in again with you guys later.